Mind if I join you? Eh? I was supposed to be your new co-driver. Yeah? It was fixed up over the blower. They told me in Marble Bar that Browns needed someone, so I rang. Yeah, me mate went crook. Lucky I was about. Lucky? For who? For me, I was out of a job. Well, you got one now. I'm off up to bring the last load of the season down. Then it's the city lights for me. Been in Australia long? A few weeks. You drive one of these? I drive anything, anywhere. Good. I'm tired. See you on the way back. So long, Rocky. All right. The starter, the handbrake, the gears. Good. One, two, three, four. Reverse. Where'd you learn to count, mate? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Reverse. One, two. And this is the wheel, see? We use it to turn bends. Only this road don't bend for a hundred mile. But when it does, be awake. Now start her up and get moving. <laughs> Rocky. Where's Dick? Uh, busted a foot last time down. Who's this new bloke? Well, they found him in Marble Bar. Longest cattle run in Australia and they found him. He drives anything. Been a professional driver. Driver? Huh. Of what? To tell you the truth, he says, I was once a lady chauffeur back in England. <laughs> well, I'd better meet him. Did Jacob meet Wolf Featherston? Ah, uh, just out from England, I presume. Yes. Ever been on a cattle station before, Walter? Not exactly. I once worked in a beef canning factory in Chicago. Oh, yes? Know anything about cattle? Well, I've always been fond of them. Maybe you'd like to drive around? Yes, if Rocky can do without me. Yes, I might just get by. Or perhaps you'd like to ride. Can you ride a horse? Certainly. <whistles> Some of my boys celebrating the end of the carting season. 
Oh, I see. Fart the next camp. There is no camp. You mean we drive non stop to the railhead at Mikathara? 400 miles to Nullagine and 400 past it. Two days, two nights, two drivers. 40 hours is your schedule. Any longer, and the cattle will start to lose weight. 40 hours a long drive. In my father's day, it took four months driving on the hoof. I remember seeing them coming when I was a kid. Go on, I'll take it first. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, your captain and I welcome you aboard and hope your journey will be a pleasant one. We will be cruising at a speed of approximately 20 miles per hour and our estimated arrival time in Mikathara is 8 a.m. the day after tomorrow. Please fasten your safety belts and refrain from smoking. <laughs> sound a long drive but back in the days when me dad was alive why it took him four months on the hoop to arrive so we're cattlemen cattlemen rolling on our way though the track is long and the dust is red and it's 40 hours till we get to bed still we're trucking them into the rail Ready. Okay. What now? All right, you can get the spear. Punctures is the one thing we've plenty of up here. I've had 20 in a trip. Not ready yet? No, put it down over there. Then come and give a hand to lift this wheel off. All right, Rocky. Won't be a second. <laughs> Well, grab me a Over by the anthill. Ants! Thousands of them! Look at the little devils! Get off me! Go! Go! I think I'm so. Go! 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 Now you know what's in them hills and it ain't gold. <laughs> Go on. Hey, yep.
Here goes half our wages for the for the trip. Come on. What now? I'll go down, find it, start all over again. Come on. Let's get going before it gets hotter. Hey. Hey. Native voice from our local station. Ha! Ha! You beauts! I thought this would cause a bit of a stir. <laughs> what were they all saying? They said, this is the first time they'd ever seen one of these things light straight off. Now use it to light some sticks and get the billy boiling. OK, Brocky. Get the tucker on while I take a look at the beast and check the other tyres. OK. Brocky? Yeah? There's no labels on these tins. Never mind. Make hash McGandy. What? Hash McGandy. You know, put in the lot. Irish stew, eh? Tropical fruit salad. <laughs> right, server up, mate. Good. Yes? Delicious. You ought to be in Sydney, cooking in one of them smart hash foundries. Yes? Yeah. That's the trouble with this outback life. No refinement. No finesse. Uh, just gobble and grab. Grab and gobble. But you Europeans, you understand the art of cuisine. Even if you can't do much else. Yeah, put some on the fire. Are we okay for diesel? Yeah, she'll be all right. Cattlemen, cattlemen, we're rolling on our way. Rolling, rolling, cattlemen, cattlemen, we're rolling on our way. The drover would camp when down came the night. Now when it gets dark, we just turns on the lights. The track keeps unwinding from left and to right. But me old man, he found the drover's life pleasing. He laughed at me with my oiling and greasing. What takes 40 hours took him a whole season. Still we're cattlemen, cattlemen, rolling on our way. Now there's half behind and there's half ahead and the road is long and the dust is red. Still it took them once for months instead. Still we're tucking them into the rail. 
cattlemen are rolling on our way. Rolling, rolling, cattlemen, cattlemen are rolling on our way. Come on, let's get some of the dust out of our throats. <laughs> Suits me. There's a billabong just down here. Come on. Say England has some lovely gardens. England is a garden. Oh, is it? Croaky on the lawn and muffins with a vicar and all that sort of stuff, eh? Huh. Not like this dry, burnt country. If you don't like it here, mate, you know what you can do. But I do like it. I like the peace and the space and the freedom from convention. Yeah. Come on, next stop, Nullagine. Again. Rush hour in Nullagine. That's it. Paris of the Northwest. Looks pretty good to me. What a country. Corrugated iron roofs and corrugated iron roads. Mm, cold. The beer in this country makes all my teeth ache. We like to drink it, not shave in it. Go on. Your turn to pay. And drive. All right. Be seeing you, Brocky. Sleep, didn't you? You no hoper. Uh, yeah. Ah, what's the use? I gotta watch you all the time like a kid, haven't I, Featherston? There'll be trouble somewhere. Yeah, I thought as much. Looks like a loose pin underneath. Give me the 12-inch crescent. Oh, I can drive anything anywhere. Duh. I ought to sack you on the spot, you drongo. Well, 
they could find for me a marble bar was the village no hoper. You're about as welcome up in this country as a glass of warm beer. Best. Oh, do I? What's up? Had an overdose of ugly pills? No. No, an overdose of you. Let up, Rocky. I didn't mean any. is red and we're looking along to the road ahead but there must be better ways of burning your bread it took them once for months instead still we're trucking them into the rail head cattlemen cattlemen are rolling on our wrong this time? Well, I don't know. She was going all right, and then she started sort of coughing and then backed up on me. Well, let's have a look. <clears throat> ah, she's dead. Not much we can do now. It'll be dawn in an hour or so. Yeah, OK. And let's have a brew up amongst those rocks over there. Right. Oh, and save the battery, Wall. OK. Busted fuel line. Must have been a stone. Ah, it's easy fixed. OK, I'll get the soldering kit. Brocky! Yeah, what is it? The toolbox is shaken open. Everything's gone. Ah. Never mind, we'll improvise something. Back in England, we used to... Well, you're not back in England now. And this is not her ladyship's roles. Well, I do know something about engines, if you weren't too pig-headed to learn from a new Australian. Ah, shut up! There's a mining camp a few miles down the road. I'll get some gear from them. At least the cattle look all right. Oh, make yourself at home. You're in for a long wait.
That's it. Yeah, that's it, all right. Look at the parrots. Oh, yeah, galahs. In Australia, we say that word for a fool. You know, when I first met you, I thought you was a real galah. Well, we didn't make such a bad team after all, Brocky. No, well, not such a bad team. What now, Brocky? The city? Yeah, had the north for a while. I think I'll look for something down in Perth. Maybe we could get an off-season job as driver and co-driver. Huh? Well, we can try. Since me father's days, our ways have parted. And that's no reason for being downhearted. We've finished the drive and the cattle are carted. When the old time drover would hardly have started. Cattleman, cattleman, rolling on our way. Cattleman, cattleman, rolling on our way. Rolling on our way. Rolling on our way. Cattleman, cattleman, rolling on our way. 